The ballistics gel test is a good way of knowing how powerful your pellet gun is since it's the same consistency as flesh, but it's also really expensive. That's why I generally test my air guns in Play-Doh instead. What I have here is a block of ballistics gel and a block of Play-Doh. Both Play-Doh and ballistics gel are soft targets, so a pellet should behave similarly in both mediums when fired out of the same gun at the same power. Of course, the Play-Doh is denser than the ballistics gel, so a pellet won't travel as far into it as it would into the gel. But it would still be possible to tell how far a pellet would travel into ballistics gel using the Play-Doh test. For this test, I'll be shooting H&N Barracuda green pellets into the ballistics gel and the Play-Doh out of a Crossman American Classic in 177 caliber at 10 pumps. Amazingly, the pellet penetrated almost exactly the same depth into the Play-Doh as it did the ballistics gel. So Play-Doh actually also has a similar consistency to flesh. Who would have thought? Play-Doh is 50 cents a can, so you could easily do a ballistics gel test for an air gun in under $5 with this stuff.